In the early 2000s, a study was done surveying individuals with this question. If you were in dire need of help, how many people would you be able to call? That average number was six. But today, in 2021, it's zero. There's a missing piece in all of our lives. It was created by God for our enjoyment and growth. According to Acts 2, the Holy Spirit actually thrives off of this very element that is often neglected in our society. You know what it is? Friendship. Deep, true relationships. Perhaps this is one of the reasons we struggle in our relationship with God because we struggle to live vulnerably with one another. It may seem like you're connected through emails, text messages, social media, Instagram, Facebook, etc. But until you truly live vulnerably, then you continue to actually neglect your humanity. Listen carefully. To be vulnerable is to be human. And to be vulnerable is to declare that you are not afraid of being. Our lives are in God's hands. Our body, our soul, and spirit was made for Him. We have nothing to be afraid of. We have nothing to be ashamed of. We've been made in the image of Jesus Christ. And I tell you, friend, if you have not lived vulnerably yet, you haven't touched your humanity yet. I share this truth with you to challenge you and to encourage you and give you hope to let you know that freedom actually awaits your decision to live vulnerably because where the spirit of the Lord is there is liberty. He empowers you to live freely and vulnerably. <laughs>